Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the Mario Superstar Baseball National Anthem. This is the first ever Dinger City inaugural playoffs, and we are so excited to get this rolling as tradition. We will watch the intro to the game, and then we will get into this wonderful series of Joey versus Maddie. One player who's never been to the World Series, and one who's shown up and lost. Whoever walks away a winner tonight is the first time they have ever won this belt. And, By themselves. And the last time this belt will be given away. Please join us for the games. We're very excited. Let's do it. Dinger City in, baby. And we are here with the players. Here are their lineups. Look them over real quick because we are about to get into it. Let me read over the com uh, the uh, the draft picks rather. But first, let me talk to you about my commentary booth. We have Crit Den Dennis on the left. I am Crit Nick. It's very nice to see you all. And we have Tyler, aka Wonder Bear HD, right here. Now, happy to be here, Nick. Maddie, sorry, Joey being the higher seed got to pick whether he wanted to pick first or second or home or away. Joey picked home team, which is very interesting, which let Maddie go Bowser first pick. Joey then followed up with DK Bro. Maddie goes Yoshi PD. Joey goes Boo KB. Maddie goes Toadsworth Magikoopa. Joey goes Birdo Paratroopa. Maddie goes Wario Mario. Joey goes Green Drybones Diddy Kong. Maddie goes Daisy, Luigi, and Joey 
finishes the draft off with Toadette. And you know, the, the thing uh, I have to say is interesting line of construction with Bowser. Uh, we see him hitting three. We haven't really seen him hit, maybe out of the one-two spot in a while. And uh, it's definitely not going to pay off this inning because now there's three outs and we're going to the bottom of the first inning. Booyah, baby. I... I've been I've been thinking about this set like all week. Mm -hmm. Like when we knew like okay, these two competitors, Joey and Maddie are going to be the finalists. I've been trying to think about it. For one, I don't think any of y'all guessed that Joey and Maddie would be the finalists, but that's why Dinger City and Mario Superstar Baseball are so great because anybody can beat anybody and we might see that here today. Joey may be a seed higher than Maddie. However, they are both titans of Mario Superstar Baseball. We're all about equal opportunity here at Dinger City. Yeah, like I should have been in this chair playing the you World Series. You are in that chair. <laughs> <laughs> I should have been in the chair I'm sitting in. Anyways, I don't know what Joey's strategy was giving Maddie first pick. It's interesting because um, the last time we saw Joey, we, um, you know, it was the semis against Gil. And I believe every single matchup of that, you know, series, whoever got like the ability to choose first picked Bowser every game. Right. I don't know if it necessarily coincided with a win every time, but it was like they, both players were on the let me get Bowser or else train. I think Joey just really didn't want to give him Boomer. And I think by that he opted to go home because he would at least wrap up the having last licks knowing Maddie would go Bowser, and I think he feels more comfortable walking Bowser than having to maybe pitch to a Boomer um, and maybe a potential Bowser. So, or maybe, you know, the bo the Boomer DK, I think had, had Joey gone first pick, he definitely would have gone Bowser. We would have seen a Bowser first pick. Then Maddie locks it up with DK Boomer. And we've seen Maddie's DK and Maddie's DK Boomer this entire playoff series. So good rip. And that ball's freaking enough. cracked. It's going to land. Wow. It's going to land. Wow. What wow. A, yeah, that was a rip. Um, the only thing that I could see for that this type of strategy would be like, okay, well, I want to get Bowser a certain number of times, but whoever gets Bowser first would, if you went to seven, hypothetically, would get Bowser four, uh, four times, and the opponent would only get three. All Joey right, and Joey quickly threw a small misplay from Maddie's part on the field. Joey scores the first run of the game. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, it's really fun to see that uh, you can't see it, but we can. Everyone is clapping after almost... Every half inning, yeah, uh, and every run uh, score. It's very cute. I love it. Yes, as you, as you yes, saw let's during, go. Let's go. <laughs> as you saw during the national Ooh. anthem, we have a few of the uh, other players here. Lionel, Tommy, Jason, Andrew are all sitting on the couch over there. And some still to come. And, and yes, yeah, so, some other people may be here later. We're going to do, and that is a second run for Joey. Let's go. that baby. <laughs> we, you love to see it. Just kidding. Anyways, I don't. <laughs> I, don't yeah, I do like not. Don't. But um, we're going to have a rotating commentary booth. It's going to be most likely two of us and then one other person coming in and switching out for us uh, as the evening goes on. So anticipate seeing more faces in the commentary booth as the evening progresses. Yeah. Yes, we have uh, counting the players, 10 cl total club members today. And we decided to, uh, we did a little blind tally. I won't say who voted for what, but the players went out of the room and everybody drew on the right board, whiteboard who they thought was going to win the World Series. Uh, out of the uh, the nine votes that we counted for, three people voted for Maddie, six voted for Joey. So I don't know if that's a mixture of hearts, brains, both, neither. But uh, we got, uh, the, the room is 33% with Maddie, 66%. With Joey. Listen, mm -hmm. but like like uh, like we've said, it, this could go any sort of way because sure. both of these players just have played out of their minds this entire bracket to get to this point. Mm -hmm. Joey going against Gil, putting up between the two of them ninety five runs, Crazy coming back seen. from getting grand slammed on time and time again. Maddie fighting off Jason. It was, uh, I don't remember what happened in those games. I don't think I was on commentary, <laughs> but like, <laughs> I'm just saying these players both had to work very hard to get here. Ma Maddie had to, to Maddie had to slay Jason who Jason before that slayed Andrew and Dennis. So he was that, oh man, dude, it's, it's just been a, it's been a hell of a ride to get here. And Maddie took you out too. Maddie did take me out. Yeah. But like, whatever. <laughs> you did good. You did good. My boy. <laughs> Uh, yeah. I, I, I gotta say, um, 
Maddie is we, we a lot of people in this club often say Ooh, Wow, what a catch from Matt. Nah. People in this club say Maddie's the best hitter we have to offer a lot. He hasn't got a hit yet. Is that true? Yeah. Oh, Joey wow. is uh Joey is pitching like some kind of master. Uncaged beast. Yep. Joey's pitching Just like Just kidding. Joey sucks. <laughs> boo. Here comes dude. the unload from Maddie. Yeah, dude, Joey. I was going to say, Joey is not pitching like someone who has not been playing the game for the past few days. Joey had one warm-up game today, mm -hmm. and uh, before that, I don't even know, because he's been moving out the past few days. He's got a cat now, right? Two. Two? Two cats. Two little kick cats. How do you go from zero to two? Like, I feel like there's a stop in between, usually. He's going to catch that. I can't Oh, oh no, my he God. Died. I, I have no idea what just happened, but he dropped that ball. Petey's not on first. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Try, we will try not to get involved like that after uh, after that play. That wasn't coaching. Yeah, it was coaching. I'm, I was letting you. I was stating the game state. Whatever they oh. do, with that information's up to them. <laughs> you gotta land this if you're Maddie right here. And he oh, he's gonna get a double play. Double, double, double play. That's a fat. That ball. is All right. Double play oh, removes no. the man from third. Uh, this was looking like a. It went from a great inning to still a fine one, having somebody scoring on second. But That's and that hit. is gonna land. We have laser. Will it bring in Bowser? It will not. No, it will not. Not with that. Not with laser. All right, who no we got way. up with this situation? Marty with two Mario, stars. Mario. Okay, you could fireball or you could, could just try to land it, and that is it's landing. Land. And Toadad, who's such a good fielder, doesn't get it. That's a Yoshi exclusive. Was well, it sarcasm? Exclusive. Who knows? Yoshi exclusive. <laughs> Listen, man. Like, like we said, we, we've roasted, I think we've roasted Toad out enough. I don't know if we need to roast her in the World Series, Very true. but Very it's true. just like, there's she some balls that it. nobody gets except for Yoshi, yes. so. I, it's worth noting that Toad had almost stopped Joey from getting here with a nasty bobble in the semis. Right, that's true. All right, and Maddie tying the game up it's two to two. Nice and competitive. Base is loaded. Daisy up. He's got Daisy Ball as an option. He can charge for a dinger with that chemistry. He can go for the slap hit. I think he can go for a bunt. I think he's gonna do a slap hit here. He's really good at hitting with Daisy. Da Maddie is very talented at hitting. If with it Daisy. were someone else, maybe I'd say a Daisy Ball or something. Right, of and that yep, nature. any bag, any All bag. Right. Made poor contact, and that ends the inning. Joey scrapes that one out, two to two, bottom of the fourth. KB up with a star chance. Very dramatic. <laughs> very dramatic. If uh, if he gets on right here and he wins a star chance, that's five to two stars. That is not a place I want to be in. No, and when it's a, when it's true. a tie ball game yeah. like that, no. Absolutely and and, not. and absolutely Joey's not. home. Yeah. Great Ooh, pitch. That's a, that's a big star for Maddie there. Yeah. So some people say that the away team is better because you can unload your stars first and then gain them back. But there's something to be said about the home team being last able to licks, conserve man. their stars until last licks until that bottom of the nine inning. And also, if you're trying to be fast, like technically, you get to play. You play less baseball. Yeah. If you win. And at the same time, if you're, you could counter pick what your opponent does because they are always going ahead of you. Oh, so you oh can my God! Party. What so a good. play! Great play! Yeah, great, great play. play! All right, perfectly tied up game in hits and runs at the bottom of the fourth. That's what you expect from two Titans, man. Mm -hmm. But uh, either one of them has the potential to pop mm -hmm. off. Oof! That's a that is a bad start. I, I will say that Maddie, typically. He just has those innings where he's like, oh, I literally exploded. And Joey plays more consistent. Like, mm -hmm. all right, a few runs here, a few runs there. Sure. Uh, but, I mean, I guess we'll just have to see whichever one, whichever strategy works out better. It outlasted Gil last time. And I would say Gil plays. Uh, he doesn't play necessarily similar to Maddie, But I think he has that same, like, I'm blowing up right now or I'm not getting anything. Mm -hmm. So Absolutely. Absolutely. Joey outlived it once. Same exact spot as the last time. Is Joey going to get under? He gets underneath it that time. And uh, Bowser has been on first base and uh, pitched around. Yeah, Whole I mean, ba Bowser in the three hole, it's just, I, I don't like him. There I don't personally. like it either. I like, no. and, th and you know, that that's the thing. That's why I love when the game starts. We always had a little intermission uh, to talk about what we do like and don't like about the lineups. And we did yeah. say we didn't like Bowser in the three hole for that exact reason. I'm a big Bowser two hole guy. You do like first base. Uh, you first up, you do like a really reliable like a Yoshi, like a Yoshi. Yeah, and then you do Bowser second, and then you do someone. I usually put a captain character third that even though it might cost two stars, you have the like option. doing Birdo's egg right. with the two people on base is pretty gnarly. I would say the same applies to maybe like DK. Um, maybe even like, a, I mean, it would be weird, but I could see the case being made for a Wario. Mm -hmm. 
I think DK. I think that's a great option because if he puts it in play, if he go, if the Bulls hit to right field, yeah. Boo is just taking third base, and then it's an automatic sack oh, wow. which gives wow. you the double play, the double play. Mario, Mario, that Gnarly was a that was a play. gorgeous double play sliding into second base. He still needed to gain control of Mario, but he didn't panic. He didn't hesitate to. He didn't put like input anything wrong. Mm -hmm. That was a perfect input. Mm -hmm. A lot of players will accidentally. That was interesting. Yeah, that was an interesting uh, choice. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of players I've seen accidentally uh, like buffer the wrong input and throw it Ooh. at first there, but uh, that was executed a perfectly, perfect, very well on Maddie's end. Um, uh, listen, a lot of people don't like the Marios, the Luigi's, the Daisies, the Peaches, the shortstops. I think they make enough plays to where it's like, if you really just want to go who you're comfortable with at the plate, I don't think it hurts you too much to maybe go Mario because he does have an okay arm and he can, he does have sliding catch. Him, yeah, listen, right? Mario, yes, he does. Mario and Daisy definitely are making more plays than Bowser does in that mm -hmm. location sure. in shortstop. Uh, Luigi, not so much because he doesn't have sliding catch. He has super mm -hmm. jump, which right. we found typically hinders a middle infielder quite a bit yeah, because you want you, a first and third with your super jumpers probably yeah because if you accidentally like if if an input goes wrong your super jumper just jumps straight over, over the ball <laughs> which is just you know not great you see it in the practice mode all the time with paratroopa mm -hmm. and i mean people don't do it so you don't really see it on the channel but in hate fielding you've probably seen it boo is terrible. pretty notorious for oh. it for being so small but yeah. having such a high vertical. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, yeah, Bowser got glitched on the bag there, putting uh, Bones on first base. Yeah, yeah but Joseph. For Diddy Kong. I mean, you could you could do a Diddy Banana, but it doesn't feel like the right time. No, yeah. absolutely not. I don't think it is. Not either. on two outs. If you had a man on like second and third, I'd probably be like, it's it worth it. It's worth yeah. a shot. I, yeah, I, I really don't like Joey's bottom lineup with, with, uh, with Diddy, with Paratroopa, and with Toadette. I know we got a hit with Toadette. But I think those three bottoms, when you when they all can really only hit Great singles, Luigi hit. What what's his bottom? Say it again. It was Diddy Kong, Paratrooper, right. and Toadette. Okay. I think Paratrooper should probably be played higher in the lineup. So do I. But I don't know how good Joey is with his regular bat. Because I mean, personally, I've been pretty on fire lately, playing on and off camera with Paratrooper's non star bat. But uh, I know not everybody likes it that much. And that is a play. Beautiful I, play from King Boo. It was a great play, but I got to say, that felt like a really good opportunity for a Yoshi egg to me, knowing you get toed up, toed, uh, Toadsworth into Bowser. Well, don't worry. If, you just do that. Well, <laughs> well, no, I'm saying for the hitter. Like, if you, if you Yoshi egg there, you almost certainly get on base. And then if Toadsworth does that, Bowser still gets to come up. I feel like, like our, our oh, wow, what that was a really, really early dive. I'm Elbow surprised he still got the ball. On yeah, that, that was strange looking, but two, play. two, two yeah. hits, two, 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 two hits. Um, Listen, that that's just how it is, man. Pete, some people are gonna be better with other character singles bats. Like personally, I'm I've been super terrible with Toadette singles bat, but like a player like Joey can make her look pretty dang yeah. good. I think this is a really good lineup uh, if you're. Oh my, oh my gosh. gosh. Golden Bowser, Glove. Bowser catching everything on third. Yeah. I the definitely think man. I definitely think Daisy's the pitcher to, to at least be successful with Toadette because she doesn't have as much curve speed um, to really finagle the plate. And I think that with Toadette, because there's Yoshi, there's 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 Boo, there's Diddy, who could really throw the ball in and off the plate, and her contact point is kind of small. Um, you know, it, it's not gonna always work out, but he's he's making it work. He's he's punishing any pitch that's relatively near the plate, and he's gonna uh, he's gonna he's gonna get out of this inning, but go to the top of the eighth inning with Bowser leading off in a star chance. I gotta say it was interesting seeing um he went for the banana ball there for two stars, but you know I guess the philosophy for for Yoshi banana applies to Toadette. She is fast. She enough. can score. She should be able to do it. You gotta get on base there, but yeah. it's something Joey can do. Yeah. All right. Now, now, uh, Manny is up. A ding dong would score him two runs here, but uh, he gets a little. He chose not to. <laughs> yeah. Dumb. I would have done that. Oh yeah. Uh, I would have also chosen. No. Yeah. He, he's a little impatient with that at bat, but uh, so a character Great like Magic could Great star hit. Great star hit. And see, once again, that star hit proving why Yoshi is just the best left fielder in the game because, like. I guess that was just a single, but it did go to the wall. If it was like a little slower and went to the wall, like Bone still probably wouldn't have gotten it. He would have cut it off. Double. And also yeah. with Bowser being the guy going the third, you kind of have to be careful. He's pretty slow. Right. I think anyone that isn't the heavy does make it the third there, even if it does exactly the same. Double. Oh! Oh! oh, 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 oh. All right. 
You got the okay. out in second. Right, that yeah. was a double play. Honor. That was a ground ball double play. It, it, I mean, it would have been. It would have been. <laughs> Berto just decided ball. to bow. Well, yeah. Who's your uh, okay, favorite he's character sure, he's in the game now? For the, he's looking for the fireball. Or at least he was. Not oh, he gets it. I'm really shocked Woo. he still pitched and the Mario there. going to third. Gorgeous. Oh, oh, no. All right. Bold choice to go for that. But, you know, you got the run. Maddie has made a lot of outs at third base this postseason. A lot of outs at third base. Yeah, I mean, he he was confident there. And it was fucking crack! Nina Penta Santa Maria! The first dinger of the Dinger C City World Series, ladies and gentlemen. Joey puts a solo shot up with <laughs> Hammer Bro. Oh, my god! Oh, gosh. my God. And a gorgeous oh, no. end, too. Yeah, that's that's putting him sure. right on second. And he yeah. just took this lead to a tie to a man Dude, on second Maddie base. Dude, said, yo, I'm up a run. What are you going to do? And Joey said, I'm going to crack one out and then go for an egg and then get a gorgeous shot with KB. Oh, it's wow, off the wall. Air ball. Uh, that's a really tough place. I don't know if I would have dove, if I would have jumped. Um, I thought maybe his hitbox was going to catch it. I thought he was going to get that. So did I. Yeah. Maddie's going to have to pitch like a god here. Oh, he's bunting. Quick throw. Quick throw over. Oh, oh, and it was oh, anti. I the anti, but it was too close, so they got the play anyways. I thought the oh, anti screwed him. Oh my goodness! I oh, forgot all about goodness. their anti. Oh, that was excellent. Know, she's not getting to it. All right, wow. base is loaded. Only one out. Base is loaded into. We might see another paratroopa Dennis. into Toadette. And you know what? Paratroopa is. A, he's got a great star head. He's also a great glitch bunter. So, either way, it, this could be gnarly. Worst case scenario was a double play. For yeah, Joe. Oh, for no. sure. I mean, that's the worst best case, case scenario. scenario for Maddie, but. Best case scenario for Joey is he hits a home run somehow. Just does it. He just does it. That <laughs> star swing over he the is, fence. He just dings it right over the fence. Like a god. Double that, play. That's a double oh, play. That, no, oh. not a double play. Oh, wow. Okay. Took his sweet time picking it up. All right, Toadette. So you know, Toadette is currently, I think, either two for two or three for she's three She's two for two, point. I believe. Maybe three for three. But she's, she's got to do what she's inning. been doing. Yeah. Three for three. Three for three. Let's see if wow. she can do it where it matters. All right. Getting a little eager there. Okay. Good right, read. Good read. Let's see what she can do. We have a 2-2 two -two count. This is a pure. Oh, oh he gets her. Man, a wow. little sleight of hand, trick of the eye from Maddie. The game is still 3-3 three to three going into the top of the ninth. Maddie with a weird lineup, but it is a Maddie lineup if I've ever seen one. This man can hit with both of these players. I I'm excited. Yeah. Oh, I yeah, am. Anything can happen. And Maddie is up three stars three to stars. Joey Zero. You know what I'm really surprised it's gonna about? Land. It's going to land. I'm More very, evidence of Yoshi being super important in a game like this. I'm I'm very surprised he didn't maybe Daisy Star there with the Toadette. Just just to just secure it. Oh, he the, does uh, it again. He's incredible. Yeah, he's incredible. He can hit with. Oh, he, he, oh god! Now, anyone, I said it before, and I'll say it again. Is this a? He does it this time. That's an egg. That's an egg. That's an egg. Oh, and he's on base. That's They're a great all on egg. Base, ladies and gentlemen. That is three men up into Toadsworth into Bowser. I know what okay. I do if I'm Maddie here, and it's not that. Yep. You, you don't want to double play. You don't want to double play. And, and you're not getting it. And that's a beautiful run. hit. Huge that's a run. Hit. Maddie goes up 4-3 in the top of the ninth. And you're forced, into Bowser. forced to pitch now. I was going to say, if I was Toadsworth, I was charging. And, and that's the value. That's the value of the Yoshi egg. He's pitching. He has to. He doesn't have to, but oh my he God. He doesn't have to, but you like. Really wanna, you got to strike these guys out. All right. All right. Here we go. This is a tight spot. It's no stars to no stars, four to three, but Maddie yeah. in a beautiful position. Oh, and that that's a grand slam! Oh, oh, oh my god! The grand slam is wrong! Stop it! Maddie at the window! Oh my <laughs> oh god, my dude. God. Maddie in his bag right now, still winning, but it's an out! And a close crack oh, as well! No. Oh my god! Oh my god! Two grand slams taken oh. away from Maddie! One by Joey, one by fate! <laughs> I poop myself. Dude, you're in a suit, that's so unfortunate. It's terrible. Oh, oh my god! Gosh. What a play! All Joey! Right. Joey, against all odds, gets out of that inning with only one run scored. And a great Field to Bowser Grand Slam. Strikes out PD Piranha. Does whatever that last oh guy god, did. I was so distracted. I don't care. Oh my god. Not a high. double. Not a double. Not a double to the Yoshi. Yoshi. He is a god. Oh my god. This dude. is tight. Oh, he's going for the DK. Oh, oh, oh it's not going to okay. happen. It's not going to happen. Who's got to go back? Okay. Oh, dude, could you imagine? This is uh, this game is tight. You have no stars. You gotta, you gotta. I mean, like, I mean, I, I'm not gonna tell. He's walking. Yeah, I was like, 
I think saying obvious things isn't coaching, but I think, yeah, the walk was right there, I feel. It's going to be a catch. Now, that's a catch. All right. In advance, boo. Do. In the KB. I think I'd go for the hit. I don't I don't know. There's there's a lot of different options with Bones, KB here. Bones No Star is still a really good singles hitter. Yeah. Do we know who's up after <laughs> Bones? Does anyone have that photogenic memory? I have no um, idea. After Bones, I think it's Diddy. Diddy. That's interesting. If Diddy doesn't get up if they run so the you score. could you could walk KB, hope you get out Bones, or that he only hits a single. The only thing and then is, you go into extras and you have to only deal with Diddy. I but Diddy could glitch bun. But the thing so, is, he doesn't have a he doesn't have a laser character in the infield. Yeah, there's a lot of it's things. That, there's a lot of things to deal with here. Dude, I don't. Like I would this much move. rather pitch against KB than. I mean, I guess Bones is no stars, but still, this without is, Birdo in my infield, I'm scared of Bones' bat. So Bones has a great bat. Bones is a great bat. This is spooky. This is a spooky sign. Doing some movements here. Okay. We do have laser in the infield with Bowser on third. Yeah, you got, third. you got Bowser with laser. You got Yoshi open to you. This is there's a, a lot of there's a lot of ways you could change this around. This is an interesting decision on all fronts. Okay, he's making it so that if the ball rolls to third, he's got a chemistry to throw to Luigi. Can't say that's a bad idea. You got laser in the infield. Two big two big bodies. I don't even know what I do here. Here we go. It's a ball. It's a ball off the bat. That's a hit. No, no, it's not. no it is Mario not. Jumps Maddie. Off the game. That is the game. Maddie takes game one. Goes up 1-0 on Joey. Maddie only needs three more to win this World Series. Joey needs four. We will be moving on to game two tomorrow. What a game. 12 to 13 hits. Holy crud. Wow. Oh Absolutely game. gnarly. And Great you know, game. Incredible. And if you like this game so much, uh, throw a like, subscribe, um, smash the bell, get notifications whenever we come up with a new video. And also, join the Discord that's down below and become a Patreon member. Nick, tell them about the Patreon benefits. Oh my god, there are so many Patreon benefits. You can read through them all if you click on mm -hmm. the link down below. At any level, you get a baseball card just like this Boom. one. Holy crud. And the uh, $10 level, the Bowser tier patrons have been getting all of these playoff games early. Not by these. the time you're <laughs> by the time you're seeing this, are we giving them the World Series early? No. No, okay, never mind. <laughs> Fuck you guys, I guess. <laughs> but like they they've got they've been getting all of the playoffs early before that. Um consider it for next season the $5 level and up gives you the regular season games at the beginning of the week instead of dispersed throughout the week. So anyways, Thank you so much. We've been Dinger City. We love you and we will see you tomorrow for game 2 of this amazing series. Dinger City out.